So the drive here is going to be a no movement, no adjustment. The only thing we're going to do is that we're going to set four and a half bar top spin. We're going to then pull back depending on the wind strength that we are having. So for 14.4, we shall in this case pull back 0.8 rings. And that we do with the ball guideline pointing straight up. Obviously, the pullback will be slightly different for a POC 7 and a POC 5 and 6 due to different accuracies. I have that in mind. 0 0.8 ball, left curl, hit perfect. And the goal here is to get somewhere around 505 to 520 yards. Have in mind that if you are unlucky and you would roll into the rough there at the top, it's a super simple save for an eagle. So there is nothing to be afraid of when it comes to this shot. We're keeping it free to play, playing with a berserker. For the second shot, we are going to use uh, the backspin that is four backspin to right spin. We start with that one because the range position is not relevant here. We're looking to find the sticky spot, which is going to be fine. You can see when you're wiggling around there a little bit. Want the ball guideline to be half a green square short of pin, and, and the the distance of the tip of the ball guideline should be just to where the cup ends. Now, from plus 14, we play max plus 45 P5 numbers. So having a plus 20, I'm adding 0 0.6 to my adjustment. And that is a lot of rings. So make sure that you give yourself the time. So center the ball, hit perfect. And even, I mean, I, I'm not going to sit here and say that this is going to drop every time because it's not. This is going to be a safe eagle with an outside chance for an albatross. And if you're lucky, you get it to drop like me, then center for an albatross on hole three. Get the guide on patreon.com slash golf clash Tommy.